Hello, and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for coming back. Uh, today's project is actually on the car. <laughs> Something that uh, I mentioned in the very first video I did about this car, the wheels are in really rough shape. And between Texas and Colorado, I think, you know, a lot of the chipping and paint and junk coming off of it, um, it's just bad and it looks terrible. Um, the wheels are in good shape. There's a little bit of curb rash on the back too because it's so wide. Um, and judging <laughs> depths and distances and widths is very difficult in this car, um, as I find when I'm parking it, especially in close quarters. But anyway, we're going to get that done today. The process is actually pretty simple. They basically take the wheel and the tire off. They take the tire off the wheel and then, um, you know, clean up the curb rash, any imperfections in the, in the wheel itself. Um, and then they powder coat it. And in this case, we're going black to match the black to match the black. And um, I'm, I'm really excited about it because A, it's gonna totally transform the way the car looks, but also B, it's actually gonna fix a lot of the problems that these tires and wheels kind of have as a, as a whole. Um, and just the cleaning up the appearance. Because um, the car, as you guys have seen, is in fantastic shape, especially post uh, paint protection, correction. Um, but uh, anyway, so I'm really excited to get this done. Um, I did it actually myself to the Audi and uh, they turned out really well until about a month ago or so. It appears there are curbs that like those 21 inch wheels. May have to end up doing those again. <laughs> but anyway, so super easy process. Um, it's super time consuming though. And especially with powder coating, you have to actually bake the wheel uh, when the process is done when the application is done to ensure that it creates a nice tight seal. So anyway, we're gonna go do that now. Well, we can thank Georgia 400 for the newly acquired dirt and mud on there. Jeez. Uh, only like four more years of it. Awesome. Uh, so going back with like a glossy black on black color, which I think will look good, but it also hide a lot more of the dirt. Well, unless it's red Georgia clay. Um, <laughs> Really excited to get this done though. And um, yeah, the guys over here at Alloy Repair uh, Wheel, Real, Alloy Re Wheel Repair, geez, are uh, knocking this out. 24 hour process, which is pretty cool. Okay, so not 24 hours, 48. We ran into a little bit of a snag, but look at this. <gasps> Looks so good. I mean, come on. <laughs> I tried to get them to do the tires too, to match our, I'm just kidding, you can't do that, it's rubber. Um, do not try to powder coat your tires. But, uh, so color matched to the body, obviously, and I just cleaned it up, because you saw it when it was nasty. Um, but I mean, this is just next level. I am in love. And of course they kept the decal, or the uh, crest. Um, but this just looks so good. Now, my eye is drawn though <laughs> to that. That's not good. And that just looks amazing. And that pop of the red on the calipers is perfect. So I'm really happy with how these turned out. The finish is just enough to kind of complement. It doesn't take it over. You know, the car is actually in really good shape as you guys have seen. I mean, you can look at that reflect. So I was a little worried about these being like perfect and then, you know, seeing little imperfections and stuff, but as a whole, I think it matches really well. Well, I'm super happy with the results. Um, I think they look amazing. I do need to do something with that one trim piece uh, that you see like the little gray kind of faded trim inside the turbo vents. Um, and I'm working on getting something to try out a couple different things on that potentially, but, uh, and then some sort of like tire, uh, not shine, but like, conditioner maybe is that, is that the right word i don't know but thank you guys so much for coming back uh to the channel here again really do appreciate it got a ton more content coming and uh, some really cool car stuff actually over the next week or two and uh, make sure your bell notifications and all are, and, uh, that they're on your bell notification also if you haven't subscribed to the channel come on man <laughs> i'm begging you now at this point it feels like at least please hit that subscribe button. It would mean a lot to me to have you come along for the ride. Daily videos, that's what we're talking about. We'll talk to you later. See you, bye. Um, they'll be saying, oh Lord, here they come.
Yeah, here we come. Huh, here we come. <laughs> here we come. Here we come.